opening scene. Oh! <laughs> what? Everyone's heads exploded! They exploded! What? Right, The Boys, season two, episode seven. I'm excited. I'm also scared. Let's go. They exploded! What? <sighs> a, a lot happened. I, ju I just finished watching it and... Let's address the elephant in the room. Um, heads exploded. Nothing but the truth. I do. Thank you. You have five minutes to make your opening speech. Oh! Oh, God! Oh. What the fuck do we do now? So, it wasn't that much that exposed the original person's head. The CIA lady's head. I don't know. What? Oh, what? They're going to check compound beans themselves, aren't they? But. Whoa. Everyone's heads exploded! They exploded! What? <gasps> oh, it looks like, like A-Train's bad because the guy replacing him exploded! Along with like... I think maybe his girlfriend... Oh! Whoa. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, um... <sighs> Homelander's son has been taken by Homelander and Stormfront to go be raised and become Homelander Jr. He's his mother. Don't worry, he'll still have a mother. Ah, oh, hey, Stormfront's Ryan! gonna be the new mum. Hey, Ryan, no, Ryan, no! I just took Ryan. <gasps> no. They're gonna make Homelander no. Jr. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, and um, Lamplight burned himself alive. Unintentionally, but still, shutting his hand. No, he's cutting his hand off. He's cutting his hand off. Oh, what? <sighs> hey, right. So, uh. What do you want me to do with this? Hey guys and gals, we're Smooky Evan Emmanuel, and uh, today we're doing a reaction review of The Boys Season 2, Episode 7. It's. 
it's a big one. So Starlight got taken by Vort's prisoner. Uh, the mum leaked their location and so forth, and Black Noir came and, and took her and beat her up. The mum's an idiot! Oh! Black Noir! <laughs> he just literally got a, just a metal... Was that a parking stick thing? Yeah, that's not the only time they fight, actually. They fight again. Oh my gosh! Black Noir! <laughs> Uh, uh, oh, the, the V, the table, it's gone. It's gone. The seven, I think. No way, she. No. No. He has a tree nut allergy. What? She gave him peanuts and it def peanuts defeated my new world. What? She gave him peanuts. She gave him peanuts and it defeated my new world. Maeve, join her. Maeve, join her. Confirmed that if you want to defeat Black Noir, you just need a bit of some nuts and peanuts. There you go. Tell the boys that. It's Black Noir, shit. Instead of making bombs, just need a, a Snickers bar. So we'll put that in the books. Epic fight scenes. Uh, a lot of porn in this episode. A lot of porn. Uh, a lot of porn. Lamplighter likes watching porn out of the seven. Uh, quite a lot of it. Yeah, I like how Homander's eagles were penises. Nice design touch. Fucking hell. I don't even know what else. This episode confirmed that he was the original member of the Seven that got kicked out and replaced by Starlight. I said that isn't one, but I forgot. He remembered, but wasn't too sure of the statue that he wanted to burn himself by. Thought she wasn't there, he just burned himself alive anyway. Oh my god! Oh my god! What? Moving on. And then Huey took his hand. He's cutting his hand off! <laughs> Yeah, because he needs that to get into places. The reactions of Huey having a hand, everyone took it very well in stride. <laughs> yes, it is. I've saved you. Let's save your daughter. No, that should be Huey hugging her. Come on, don't cock block Huey. <laughs> yes, this episode is just a bit mad, all right? So we found out that the, the cults that the Deep and A-Train are both in to get into the seven. By the way, I like the A-Train and the Deep's friendship kind of blossoming. It's quite, it's quite nice. Okay. A-Train and the Deep, are they becoming friends? I want... F yes! <laughs> Friend. It's, it's a nice relief that that's happening while heads are exploding. Even when the heads are exploding, the Deep was worried about his head. Oh, shit. <laughs> Deep's like... To be fair though, wouldn't you if you're seeing a thing of everyone's heads exploding? Clearly that's a new suit that's blowing up people's heads. Actually, you know what? That, that's mad! Someone's... The heads are exploding. Here's what I think. If anyone knows who's doing it, it's Stormfront or Homelander. Because, let's be honest, they probably organised it and made it happen to be like, right, we can't let this go on, so we need to blot the heads of the people going against us. Oh, but it looks like we're definitely doing it, it looks like we're guilty. Okay, we'll blow up a few heads of our own. Shockwave. <laughs> Other soup. <laughs> Maeve's girlfriend. I think that was Maeve's girlfriend. <laughs> uh, not ideal. Of course, Homelander's father thing. <laughs> it's like a less arty version of what happened in Kingsman. You know how it was all poofy, like explosions, nice and colourful? This wasn't that. This, this was not that. I went a bit wild. Everyone's heads exploded! They exploded! What? <gasps> oh, it looks like, like A-Train's bad because the guy replacing him exploded! Along with like... I think Maeve's girlfriend. Oh! Whoa. 
<gasps> yeah, it should. So that was great. Kind of weird. Ah. Jeez. Homeland of organising or controlling whose heads explode. I think it could be the girl from the previous episode, you know, the Eleven from Change of Things by Adult, who exploded bodies. I think it could be her. That doesn't make sense because she was in the institution the entire time. The FBI agent, her head exploded. So how can that be the institution girl if she was still in there? So there clearly is a separate person that is blowing up people's heads. That is exploding minds. Literally. Or the same person she breaks in and out. I don't know, but her Stormfront must know. Also, the opening of memes. Making someone kill a man. He's getting brainwashed. Oh, what's he gonna do to the cashier? What, he thinks his eyes fake he's a soup? Been brainwashed. Oh! Oh! Just killed an innocent man because you were brainwashed. Eyes flick when you thought it was a soup. No, it was the trick of the light! Trick of the light! Yeah, Karen's watched that and be like, Yes! This is what it'll do to you! Don't look at me! But I'm still boggled. You exploded brains! Stormfront missing her child. Amanda being like, Ah, oh, I have a child. Let's raise that. And then the mother, Butcher's wife. You can't take him away from me. He needs his mother. You didn't get a mother. You know he needs a mother. Amanda being like, You're so right. He does need a mother. Stormfront's his new mother. Flawless logic from a Nazi. Oh, Jesus. Oh. Amanda raised it. Kind of a good point. Yeah, you know. Uh, I was raised without a mother and raised in secret, you know, away from the entire world, and it fucked me up. I don't want that to happen to my kid, because he's raising him in a secret, hiding me. But it's for good reason. He's got a mother this time. He didn't have a mother. That's very true. I know what I'll do. Give him a new mother. That's a soup. Me, his father, a soup, and uh, I'll reveal the entire complex to him, fly him up, and tell him the truth that you're lying. Yeah, and now she's got no butcher, no son. Because the son is now living and can be raised by two Nazis. Wants to be the new mum. Yeah, he's fucked. Like, the chance of him being a Superman? No. No, he's going to be a Homelander Junior. Because. His new parents. Gee. For nine next week, which is mad. Maybe the wife will be like, hey, listen, uh, Butcher, I'm back. Let's let, let's be together. Right, honey, I can't wait to see you. Come here. Not so quick. Can we also go get my son back from Stormfront and Homelander? Otherwise, we're going to have a Homelander Junior and we're all kind of fucked. What? No, hello. You haven't said hello to the dog yet. You know what you are? You're bloody diabolical. He's only said that once this season. I want more diabolicals. There is some silver linings. Frenchie and Kimiko. She's teaching him the language. That's nice. That was good. Okay, there's a lot of matter. I do think the finale, we're going to find out who's blowing people's heads and Stormfront and Homeland are linked to it somehow. <sighs> so far, as WTF moments at the end of each episode. We've got Homelander killing himself. We've got soup sex. And now we've got heads exploding. I'm shook. To my core. Are you not shook? <sighs> it was mad. Guys and gals, this was insane, all right? Genuinely, I think the most... What the fuck moment was the heads exploding? I think Butcher's wife and Butcher are going to get reunited. Yes, lovely, brilliant. And she's going to be like, they took my son, so can we take down Stormfront and Homer so I can get my son back? But Butcher's probably going to take down all three of them, not just Homelander and Stormfront, because they're all three soups. All right, bye, Homelander Jr. Bye. Gap. Whenever she teaches Frenchie, I'm going to remember, so I know it too. Ugh, this is mad. Also, Hawkeye is uh, like got weird fetishes, and they expose him because he wouldn't lose contact with his mother, so again, very culty. Yeah. Yeah, very culty and weird. And A Train's like, oh, this is weird to be a part of, but I need to get back in the seven. And you know what? Shockwave's just been. So now you can get back in. If you even want to, you really want to get back in the seven now that they've just. Blowing up brains. Ugh, guys, guys, what was the most what the fuck moment in this episode? What was the moment you were like, ah! Just dad. We see where he gets fashion from and all, all that. And I thought Butcher was going to kill his dad. You're a fucking monster. Oh. <laughs> There's some father-son issues there, right? Ah. Oh, Butcher threatening Homander's father. Ah. Oh. And then I'm gonna find your two sons and their wives and their little kiddies. Your whole fucking family dies today. Oh, I don't think Butcher's bluffing. Oh. That was a mad scene because I was watching it like, damn, butchers. Is he bluffing? I don't know. He might be bluffing, but like, he does not care. It's proving you shouldn't be afraid of soup. You should be afraid of me. Oh yeah, shit. Look at him. He's got no powers, and look at the stuff he's done. He's diabolical. I can't. It's just. It's just a bit mad. It's all a bit mad. Here's just some other stuff that made me react in a very weird way. Oh, uh, Starlight. Fringe. I'm the cuck. You're not a cuck, you're in. What? Fringe. Frenchie, Kamiko, love each other, please. Yeah. Maeve's girlfriend broke up with her. 
I knew what happened. I said that last episode. I was like, okay, what's gonna happen is Maeve's girlfriend is gonna break up with her because of the plane stuff, and Maeve's maybe or someone will kill Maeve's girlfriend um, in a fit of like love anger. Now, I was right. Oh. I said she's gonna get angry and, and yep, 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 yep. See? She broke up with her and Maeve had a fit of love anger by flipping the table. She didn't kill her though, but I do think her head might have exploded in the hearing, but I'm not too sure. And then Maeve having an orgy. Maeve's orgy, I guess. As you do. <laughs> this episode is just, oh. Lamplighter to burn himself alive. Predictions. Okay. I believe next episode in the finale, Stormfront is going to die. Why do I think this? Remember this little teaser trailer thing? Yep. Hernandez face, what's that? It's purple. What's the colour of Stormfront's lightning? Purple. So she dies possibly by having her head exploded by the person that explodes heads. We, we, we'll probably find out who that is next episode. Or Homelander is the one to kill her in a fit of rage. Maybe the boys kill her. Either way, I think she's going to die. Also, Black Noir. I have a theory that Black Noir is Gus Frink's son. Hear me out. Hear me out. Who does Black Noir answer straight to? Not Homelander, no. It's Gus Frink. The body cam? The fact we know that he's got an allergy and all this stuff, and seeing his face, I think he is the son of Gus Frink. And if you're wondering about the scars, remember there was that giant explosion thing in the first episode, of course he'd have scars from that, obviously. But I do believe he's the son of Gus Frink. Yes. Oh, and Mother's Milk would either go back to his family, or possibly die. Just because we have that scene of him talking about, you know, getting out and being with his family, so, uh, yes. Unfortunately, but maybe. I hope not, because I love Mother's Milk. I think Homelander does too. Oh man, and definitely loves mother's milk. Oh jeez. Uh, what else? I think the boy is gonna get compound V. Elaborating now. Smart at the end. He's got something up his sleeve. I think they're going to inject compound V into themselves. Just putting out their finale. Compound V. The boys get superpowers. Possibly. That's a theory. I'm calling it now. Guys and guys, what did you think of this episode? Do you agree with my theory, my thoughts, and just my review and reaction? And just are you are you shook as well as I am over the whole head explosion thing? Because that was insane in the membrane. They don't have memories anymore. They. <laughs> Guys and guys, wait for my video. Comment below, let me know. I reply to every comment. It's what I do. Also, guys and guys, please go to the Patreon. It really helps me do videos like this. Keep watching, keep liking, keep sharing, keep subscribing. Subscribe. Please. Let's get to 2,000 subscribers. And also go Patreon, like I said, it really helps the channel and make me do videos like this. Helps me to do them anyway. Big thanks to the patrons as always. Sammy, Lushia, Braden, Shante, Emma, Ben Yulin, The Boys, helping to sponsor The Boys. You might have a sponsor next week. I know. Insane. This was mad. I've, I just don't know. Oh, still can't get over the brain explosion. Oh, diabolical. It's bloody diabolical. All right, it's di I can't do the voice that good, but shut up. But guys, guys, thanks for watching. Love you all so much. See you later. Oh, what, what did you think? Comment, let me know. I'd love to reply and just have a chat. It's insane. Oh, thanks for watching, guys. guys. Love you. Okay, bye. Oh. 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 Why is my milk gone black? Gary, did you tamper with my milk? That doesn't smell like milk. That's compound V. Oh no. Ah,